Kate Middleton and Prince William shower Charles with support during coronavirus crisis. Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge, and Prince William, have shown their support for Prince Charles in a heartwarming message after he was cleared from coronavirus. William and Kate praised the 71-year-old after he addressed the nation on Wednesday. This was the first time that Charles had been seen since his battle with coronavirus. During his speech, Charles thanked the NHS workers and volunteers and neighbors who are providing care for the vulnerable in their time of need. The footage was taken from the Prince of Wales home office at his Scottish residence, Burkhall, where he is currently self-isolating. The video was shared on the Clarence House Instagram account. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge also reposted the footage on their own social media page, Kensington Royal. They shared the clip alongside the message, a message from the Prince of Wales, and a star emoji reading tab to watch. In Charles' speech, he opened up about his experience with the illness. Although he suffered from mild symptoms, he described how he personally was affected by COVID-19. He said it was a strange, frustrating, and often frustrating experience. His speech also highlighted the work of Age UK, in which he is the patron of the charity, as well as Silver Lined, of which Camilla is a patron. The speech ended with details on how to stay healthy from the NHS, as well as numbers for both Age UK and Silver Line. Prince William and Kate have also doing their bit, continuously showing their support for frontline workers in the NHS. The royal couple recently lent their support to a Public Health England initiative to boost the nation's mental health during the coronavirus pandemic. The new guideline gives helpful tips on how to look after your own well-being, alongside advice for parents and carers on children's mental health during the shutdown. The Duke and Duchess also went to visit staff at an NHS 111 call centre in Croydon in March to highlight its vital work at managing the coronavirus outbreak. All the royals also took part in the nation's clap for the NHS last Thursday. The Queen shared footage of her staff clapping at Windsor Castle, while Charles and Camilla posted videos of them clapping in separate rooms from Burke Hall, as the Prince of Wales was still self-isolating at the time. Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis also took part, and were filmed clapping from their garden at Anmer Hall, much to the delight of royal fans. Meanwhile. Queen Elizabeth II has signaled it is very much business as usual at Windsor Castle. This week the monarch appointed her cousin, Lady Elizabeth Shakerley, as commander of the Royal Victorian Order according to the Court Circular. The Court Circular is the register recording every official duty carried out by members of the royal family. The entry related to the Queen dated March 31st read, the Lady Elizabeth Shakerley has been appointed a commander of the Royal Victorian Order by the Queen today and has received the insignia. The court circular doesn't mention whether this appointment took place face-to-face, -face, over the phone or via video chat. Other entries detail how the engagement was carried out by the self-isolating royals. The court circular states that, for example, Princess Anne participated in a meeting with the Lord Levy and Mr. Richard Kramer via conference call on March 31st.